How's it going everyone? Wild Dang here and welcome to a brand new Destiny video. So in today's video we are going to be looking at the Skyburners Command Beacon. I finally got one. I it dropped from a Cabal guy I think. I can't remember how I actually picked it up or I might have got it in a chest. I don't know but anyway I've got one and I'm going to show you what we need to do with it. So what we're going to do is load up the patrol on the Dreadnought and then run over to this ship that's crash landed. And what you want to do is go inside this area. Get some worm spore on the way. Obviously that is optional. <laughs> okay, and then what you want to do is go inside this ship. Kill that dude. Go up to the left here. And what we have here is like a little console that you can put the Skyburner beacon in. And it should open this here or somewhere. There is a chest nearby, so I'm guessing that's what it what you get. I mean, this chest is nowhere to be seen. So anyway, let's activate this and see what happens. The enemy weakens and retweets. Retweet? <laughs> the Cabal summon a recon team. Okay, I think that's got nothing to do with what I've just done. Or has it? Or maybe I've I've just like called in the cabal. Maybe that's what it is. Let's just kill these guys anyway. I'm guessing that's what I have to do. This is oh this is a named cabal guy there. Okay. I'm just gonna shoot all these guys and hopefully it's just got <laughs> hopefully this is actually something to do with what I'm doing. I don't actually know. So I'm just gonna shoot all these guys. Oh we've got another ship coming in. Cabal summon their champion, okay. Am I going to get annihilated? Come on, shoot the thing! Wow! Yeah, okay. Oh, I don't want to be that side of the, uh, <laughs> the enemies in. It's like right in the middle. Oh wow, oh wow, okay, okay. Calm down. Calm your tits. And go away! Thank you. Oh, if you haven't noticed guys, I have got the... Oh, who is shooting me from this side? I'm trying to hide here. And you guys are giving my position away. Something is shooting me over that way. Alright, let's just kill him. I've run out of ammo. Oh, <laughs> oh my god. Uh, recommended light level 180. I'm like 270 something. Um, yeah, I've got the black Zeros as well. I should just be able to one shot everything. Come on. <laughs> get with you. Get with you. Keep firing at you. Head glitch this. <laughs> oh crap. Who's shooting at me? Oh, the ship. <laughs> Oh wow, wow, wow! Go away! Come on! Thank you. I am going to run up this way. Come on, he might disappear. I don't know. I don't know if I'm taking too long. Oh wow, that thing hits like a freaking tank. He's dead! Yeah! What do we get? Got Skyburner deployment code, so that's for something else. Okay, so is that done anything? Now it's saying that I need to, it requires it still. Open sesame? Nope. Okay guys, I just did a little bit of research for you because I, I actually had what was dropped first. So I'm guessing someone activated it for me before and then these drop. So what we're going to do is we're going to carry on. So that's the first 
that's the first bit. So when you've got when you've got the command beacon, you activate that up there, you kill the big guy like I just did, and then you get the codes. So I'm going to show you where we have to go to actually get these codes. Well, use the codes, and then I'm going to show you what you do to get the freaking rewards. So we're going to walk up here. And we're going to go to the mausoleum. It's quite it's quite a long journey, so I might fast forward this section. I'm not sure. Okay, so now we are in the mausoleum, and I'm going to try and find where we are. Okay, no, nah. oh, it's not even a long journey. What am I on about? It's in the mausoleum. So what you want to do is we have to jump up into that doorway. So as a hunter, it's a little bit difficult. You can run up this. Oh, and then fail jumping in the freaking window. What a noob. Okay, right. Take two. One. There we go. Okay. So as you can see on my radar, we have a chest in there, and this also requires a Skyburner security pass. But the first thing we need to do is use our codes on this little console here. So we're going to activate it. And then it gives you a couple of missions to do. So signal intercept phase one. Basically, all you have to do is kill enemies at this point. So we're just going to kill some stuff. Grafted bones collected. I'm pretty sure readings indicate a piece of acolyte armor is resonating from the cabal signal. Gather grafted bones for analysis. So I'm guessing we just have to kill cabal. Okay, I've got an engram. No? Okay. What does it mean? <laughs> I'm going to see if killing are these going to spawn? What's going on? No. Alright, we have a knight over there. I really don't know where these guys are. The first time I did this, I just had to kill enemies. That was it. Okay, so we have to kill Hive. There we go. So I think this is different every time you, you activate the codes, which is pretty awesome. At least you won't get bored of doing it. Because like I said, the first time I did this, I had to just kill enemies. It didn't matter what I killed. But this time around, I have to pick up grafted bones from the hive. So let's just go this way. No, nope, this way. Give me some hive. Okay, I don't know if this will work. No. <laughs> Let's run down this way. Hello, hive enemies. Where you at? There we go. Okay, and then that's that one done. Signal's getting clearer, just not clear enough. Phase two. We need to intercept a signal. So this is the same as the one I did before. Basically, you have to run to this location before the timer ends. So just follow the arrow on your radar and you should get there in time. Just don't stop for anything, just keep running. Just keep running, just keep running. Up here. Then we're in the Hall of Souls. And we want to run over here. Up this way. Over here. Kill this guy. Jump down here. <laughs> Do we have to scan this? There we go. Scan environment. Without getting killed. Okay, that's that nice one done. Up that I've got a read on a cabal crack yeah. squad, mixing it up with the taken. Okay, so we now have another we signal to intercept. Just oh, this way. Run up this way. And like I said previously, these probably will be different for you because I did not run this last time. There are different things, which is a good thing, I think. It, it makes it different every time you complete it. And it won't feel like so much of a grind. And I was just about to jump over that wall then, to my death. <laughs> that would have been useful. I'm just going to run up here. 
Run through this door. Excuse me. Thank you very much. Run down here. Oh my god. It's taking me all over the place. And run this way. Now, do I go... Yeah, I have to go down here. Over this way. Oh, so now it's saying leader intercepted. So we've got to kill this big guy at the back here. Just going to try and take out as many enemies as I can. Warden's Knight. Okay. Blow up that brick. And then we have this big guy that we have to kill. Where'd he go? There we are. Eliminate all the things with my super bitch. And he's down. And now we have a Skyburner security pass. Kill that oh my god. He's not dying. <laughs> Alright, so next thing you want to do is run the hell out of here, or at least try. Come on, come on, run, run, run. Okay, so let's just do some serpentine. And what we need to do now is run back to the very first place that we were at. So all I'm going to do is follow this little arrow that says that we've got patrol missions available and get back to where we were. There we go, lovely. This is a pretty long, like, little tiny, like, side quest thing, but you do get some rewards. You do get a, what is it, a little fragment thing as well out of the chest. I'm not sure if I'll get one again, but we'll see. Because I've already got it. I just wanted to show you guys how this is done and what it's all about. So we're back in the mausoleum. And we need to go back up to that room. If you're in a fire team and one person has this, then it will affect all of the people in the fire team. So if one person's got the code and the beacon, then the whole fire team will get rewards. I don't know why I'm running through all these enemies, but we're going to go back through this window. What? Oh, there we go. Oh, get get that random chest. Okay, so now we can open this door because we have the security pass. So that's what we're going to do now. Um, so yeah, what you want to do is just insert the sky burner security pass and the door will open. Open sesame. And there we go, we have a lovely little loot, loot chest in here. So we need to insert this sky burner pass in that as well. And there we go guys, that's how you get to this chest. Uh, like I said, I've already done this so I didn't get the... I didn't get the little crystal thing that you get, I can't remember what they're called. The ones that Eris Morn needs. Um, so hopefully this video has helped you guys. If it has, please do smash that like button and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you in the next one. Effect is... So we spawn in. You do see that black smoke. That's all it is. That's all the dead orbit effect is. I'll try and move over here because that... That's a bit dark over there so we didn't really see it. Uh, let's try again. New monarchy does 